Hello everyone, this is David Hernandez, CX Technical Consultant Engineer, and in this video I will walk you through how to upgrade a domain in InterSite Manage Mode using a private virtual appliance. An InterSite private virtual appliance deployment is intended for an environment where you operate data centers in a disconnected mode, known as air-gapped environment. By its nature, it is not connected to the cloud which makes firmware management different from InterSight SaaS. The purpose of this video is to show you how to update the fabric interconnects and service in this mode. First of all, consider the following requirements. Ensure you read the release notes before the overheat. Ensure your equipment is compatible with the firmware version you want to go. Ensure the note is in maintenance mode as the overheat involves a reboot. In your browser, click on the link that you can find at the description of the video. It explains how to create an appliance account to download software packages. Follow these steps, accept the license agreement, and create an account name for it. This account will be only for accessing to software packages. Once it is created, log in to InterSight as you usually do and select the account. Under the Software Download tab, navigate to Firmware. In here, you will find a large list of firmware images because there is an image per model depending on the version. Look for the firmware version you want to go, click on it, and download it. Let's go back to Software Download and look for the package for the server. In this domain, I have B200M5 servers, so I look for an image that corresponds to this server. Once the downloads are completed, switch to your virtual private appliance at your browser. Then navigate to System, Software Repository, Software Files, and click on Upload Software. Browse for your server package and upload it. You can see the progress of it by clicking on this box. Prepare the procedure for the Fabric Interconnect package. Confirm that your downloads are ready to use on the Software Files tab. You may refresh the page if you don't see them. Now, under Infrastructure Service, navigate to Servers and click on the servers to be upgraded. Hit Actions and select Upgrade Firmware. It displays a list with all the firmware packages that are available. Select your version, hit Next. If you don't enable this option, the server does not get upgraded immediately. Press this button to check the progress. Once completed, verify the new firmware version for the server on the general tab. Navigate to Fabric Interconnects and click on any Fabric Interconnect that belongs to the cluster you need to operate. Once again, hit Actions and select Upgrade Firmware. Here you can see the list of Fabric Interconnects that are claimed by InterSight. The domain you click on earlier is automatically selected. 
click operate this box appears in the upper right corner if the operate action was successful press this button to check the progress An acknowledgement is required for the Fabric Interconnect to be restarted. Hit Proceed to continue. Verify that the upgrade has been completed successfully in the bundle version column of the Fabric Interconnect tab. Thank you for watching.